lobster. I am a lobster. <laughs> my nose got a little sunburn today too. I am so red right now. I like my chest hair. Why is that so funny to me? I don't know. Landon usually wears like an undergarment and so to see your skin is kind of funny I'll to me. It up. <laughs> no, we're on vacation. Show some skin. <laughs> we are on vacation. This is vlog number two of two. So if you have not seen what we are doing, go catch up and watch our latest vlog. We are here at Belize, staying at Belizean Dreams Resort, which has been amazing. So awesome. It is actually evening time. We've been in the sun. Can you tell that we have been in the sun? Lobster. Lobster face. Mm -hmm. I know. And I even had sunscreen on. <laughs> you did. But the food here has been amazing. So we're going to take you along to dinner with us tonight. This is nighttime in Belize. Welcome to the nightlife. We've got our little swimming pool here and the ocean waves you can hear out there. Should we go to dinner? Usually we eat outside, but it's kind of windy. The bartender just came up and asked us what we wanted to drink, and he said, Virgin, of course. Good memory, Mark. Good memory. He knows us too well. I said, remind me to tip this guy. Like, everybody just treats you so well. They know you by name. It's, it's amazing. Cheers. Mmm. Chocolate. Chocolate, strawberry, banana shake. Amazing. Appetizer, anyone? And now the main course. And look how pretty the potatoes are. So pretty. Good morning, everybody. The breeze is blowing. The sun is shining. If you didn't see last time's video, we went scuba diving. We had so much fun that we are going for round two today. All right, we got Rob here giving us a drive out to our dive site this morning. But his playlist only had about 10 songs on it, so I kind of took over the music department. We got Rob driving Juan, and then we got Abby. Abby, oh my gosh, I can't forget that. After our dive today, we came back, grabbed a drink, and we went straight to the beach, and we fell asleep for like, what, an hour? We laid on like the little chairs out there under some shade, probably for a good hour. Yeah. It was funny, so I brought a book along with me, huh. and I thought that we would have so much time just to like lay and relax, and it has been relaxing, but it's a different kind of work. We've been playing hard, and my body hurts so bad. My body's like, so sore everywhere. I feel like the parents, like the Wolverine parents on Hotel Transylvania 3, where they go on the ship, if you haven't seen it, you need to watch it. They go on this cruise, right, and they drop all their kids off at the daycare, and then all of a sudden they have all this energy, 
And that's how I feel. It's like we spend <laughs> literally all of our energy with our kids every day. And I'm sure people sit and watch us like jumping in the water and whatever and they're like, those guys are parents of four kids. It's like, yeah, because we have all this energy now that we're not spending on <laughs> our kids, which I love our hey, kids. We were but... like the only ones like splashing in the oh, ocean. I, know, I was like, come it's on fun. guys, get in the ocean. It's fun. I can't stop scratching my legs. I itch so bad. Oh, I got eaten flies. Yes, I need to go with some itchy cream. Well, tomorrow we got another adventure. We'll see you then. Welcome to the Belizean jungle where today we are going to go on a hike to the Mayflower waterfall. And maybe see a jaguar along the way. We'll Hopefully. see. That'd be scary. <laughs> that would be. We're going to have a lot of opportunities to see native plants and animals, so this will be really fun. Strenuous. I don't know about fun. No, it'll be fun. Lots of hard work and sweat though. Yep. <laughs> Our tour guide is teaching us a lot of cool things about the nature out here. And what are these called? Those are seeds from a copal tree. And it smells really good, but it's natural bug repellent, so I'm like trying to rub it all over me. <laughs> it's a rainforest cherry. No, it's, it's, it's actually what they call locally bird pepper. Bird pepper? Bird pepper. It, it, it is. Um... <gasps> the whole thing? <laughs> you only ate a little bit. Oh man. That's not, that's not that spicy. Yeah. It's not? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. It's a pretty little tree. Oh, that guy. <laughs> the tour guide just ate the end of his pepper. I ate seeds and all. I didn't know it was going to be that hot. <laughs> he wants to say hi. I've got fungus growing all over this tree. Isn't that crazy? Julie's getting her triathlon training in today. You go, girl. No, I was actually just catching up back to the group. Landon was like, ooh, I hear something. He thought it was like a jaguar or, a or so, oh, a monkey. a monkey. It was probably just a monkey, but he, he wanted to stop because he thought he heard something. See them? They're very small. Just a little guy. Hmm. So you get one termite tooth in the front of the teeth, and what you'll get afterwards is that carotid case. So you just crunch it in the front of your teeth? Believe him? Go, Julie. Do it, Julie. Oh, do it. Nope, here. Julie's got it. Do Julie, Julie. Oh, I'll, I'll do it. Then you come can. here, little guy. I feel like Mowgli. And then just crunch it? Yeah, just crunch it, and you'll see that taste coming out. Wow. Are they so small to even do anything? <laughs> oh, no, you can't taste it. That's, that's pretty amazing. You just ate a termite. I'll be cool, I'll give it a peer pressure, and I'll eat a termite. Yeah. Oh, come on. No, okay. Seriously? <laughs> it was crawling too fast, it was crawling like really fast. No, it, 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 no. You have to peel it before you put it in. Oh, really? Roll it in your fingers, and then put it in your mouth. Oh, you don't have to I can squeeze, okay. <laughs> Tastes like a carrot, yeah? Tastes like a carrot. Yeah. Tastes like a bug. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Gross like carrot. Check this out, we made it to our swimming hole. Pretty refreshing. Colder than the ocean water. Oh, I'm sure. One, two, three. Woo! Come and get me. Nothing in the pockets. Uh, <laughs> Do it! Woo! Ah, feels good. Honey, for our anniversary, I got you a waterfall massage. Ooh, a waterfall massage. Exotic and native only to these lands. That's my girl. Get on up here. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> so we've made some friends here at the resort. They have convinced us to go to reggae night in town. I don't know what to expect or what we're gonna do, but we're gonna slick back our hair, look hot, and we're gonna go party. Because we're adults and we can do that stuff. I wanted to be a lame adult and not. I didn't want to go, but he convinced me to. Peer pressure is an amazing thing. So we're going to go give it a shot. here in Belize and there's one thing that Landon really wanted to do while we were here and that is to go into town and visit with the locals. There's one thing about Landon and that is his love for different cultures and for people. He just loves people and loves all different cultures and so we are going to go visit with them today. Famous Alex. That's the guy right in here. Yeah, heard a lot of good things. We're coming to check you out. Awesome. I'm Landon. Alex, nice to meet you. Crocodile. Mm. Usually during the day everyone goes off and does adventures and that is what we have been doing all week and today's our like relaxed day, our chill day, which means the resort is like kind of bare. We have it all to ourselves. Almost. What do you want to do? I want to go play some Jenga. Jenga? He wants to play Jenga of all things. Okay, before we play Jenga I'm going to jump into the pool to cool off because it is hot. Have you ever been in an infinity pool where it looks like you're in the ocean? It's really, you're in a swimming pool. Get it? We literally can't do any more. We mastered Jenga. It's only like 15, 20, 30, 40 feet, 45 feet. Okay, ready? like that there you have it today is our last morning here I know it is so sad but I am so excited to get home and see my kids we have thoroughly enjoyed our time here at awesome. Belizean dreams they treated us so well they knew us by name they said we don't like to know people by their room number we like to know them by their names and so like all the staff called everyone by their first names the whole time, which I thought was super was awesome. sweet of them. So thank you so much, Belizean Dreams, for a wonderful stay. I'm going to leave a link in the description to the resort just because we had an amazing time. So if you're looking for a place to go vacation, this would not awesome. disappoint yep. totally. So thank you all so much for watching, and we will see you guys in Utah. <laughs>